Good morning, sir. Oh yeah, bud. What up, buddy? All right, let me make sure we're good. Oh, we're good on this front. Let me reset my cap card. Make sure we're golden. Oh, yeah, bud. I think we're good. Play some video games, eh? Tom Dickens. Oh, the big station, Blackwater. We can still go up fishing with Hamish Sinclair. That's actually kind of cool. I'm sure the dialogue's all different. Be like, hey, you know, I actually kind of, I kind of knew Arthur. Waz, what up? Big chilling, man. Just getting started for a bit tonight. What's going on, dude? All, dude. I actually do not love how this game looks right now for me. It is choppy. Hey, you know, as long as it's not for you guys, I don't give a fuck. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Thank you for the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Well, lucky oh, lucky man. What's going on, Swaz? What up? Extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey, hey. Bengals, man. Get over here. Let's beat the Chiefs Mr. today, Dickens? right? That's Go dope. Find old Jim Milton here. Something to do. Nice. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Making sure I work extra hard, huh? <laughs> Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Say. Is that your family getting in the morning, wagon sir. up there? Ah, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? It, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we, uh, not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, no, sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I hear that. It's kind of been through the ringer before. Trying to keep her calm. Mrs. Milton. Jim Milton. How fine you see. Yeah, Raiders one. man just collected us. Raiders one. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kind of... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. I could have played dumb. She's not wrong. I was going to milk the cows. Wouldn't have felt good about it. I'll do it. Wouldn't have felt good you about it though. Are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I thought I'd milk you some cows. Should... I'm a ranch hand, a new one at that. 
When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It was about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Oh. Where are you from, anyway, partner? Around, you know, up north, mostly. Nice, Been was. In the before, but that was nice. Ago. Oh, it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Oh. Just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. No one believes me. At all. Failed in a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> all right, then. Here's the cows. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking, yeah, but most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, just sit down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. We're milking cows. It's easy, right? Almost got a pail full. <laughs> Man, I went from gunslinging to Is that your boy? Rabbin udders. Hey, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make a dairy maid of your paw yet. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all gotta earn our keep. Fast enough, Jim. Come on. How about you and the boy uh, help me clean out the stables? Sure. Come on, son. you now, Lancelot? Twelve, sir. Ain't that grand. It's such a fine name. I like it. I got... I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> I can tell. Now, it ain't pleasant work, but it's gotta be done. Mr. Dickens said... I know what he said. How was my weekend, Swaz? It was good. Won't we, boy? It was excellent, to be mm -hmm. honest. It was a really, really good weekend. Friday was good. was really productive. Our living room's coming together now, okay. finally. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay, Jack, let's just try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Man, we're ranching. Hold on a moment. You're a long way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. You almost got me. Well, look out. Be careful, Jack. What happens when you play with shit? Look at this horse shit. My weekend was great. Yesterday we got really baked. Friday, we uh we had a productive day getting our living room set up finally. Surround sound getting hooked up and put in the proper position. It was good. It was really, really good. Drove some monster trucks in beam. Played a little Fall Guys. Played some Red Dead yesterday. I think your mother's it's been good. Somewhere. It's been good. Good weekend, for sure. Big cock Brock, dude. Brock Purdy. Reckon even your mother Brock Purdy finish things up i'll go check on her 
That's wild, man. Dude, it's super unfortunate about Jimmy. That fucking sucks. Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So. Dude. Well, you know. It's unfortunate, man. Me too. Fucking sucks, dude. I hope you guys can get the most out of Brock. That is having two, both your main starting quarterbacks go out for the season. Sucks, bro. That's fucking tough. I'll put some coffee on. Dude, right, Alt? <laughs> Feels fucking weird, dude. It's weird. It's weird, man. But hey, three straight, dude. I'm down with that sickness. That's cool. That's tight. Arma, what up? What up? What up? If it keeps you guys from, dude. I do can Brock Purdy be your Nick Foles. That's a hard ask. That guy's young. But Kyle likes him. I've heard, I've definitely read that before. Hey, no, Kyle likes him. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. <laughs> I was raised to take a man at his word and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. <sighs> but I will work hard and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Building fence. Yep, there's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Now, lift up the other side. They gotta line up, see? Now the next <laughs> rail. There's controls for this, my gosh. Anyone want to join the Bengals train with you? Nah, I'm good. Good. You guys are good, though, for sure. Okay. Fine. That yeah, okay. no, I get that, Shining. Post and pound that in. I get that, dude. It fuck, dude. It just sucks, bro. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. 
Especially for you guys, because you guys, you went through the emotion with uh, Trey Lance. Even with Trey Lance, your expectations were at least, at the minimum, make a run, you know? Be competitive through the playoffs. He breaks his ankle, and it's like, all right, season, you it feel like your season's over. And then Jimmy G comes in for a couple weeks. Shows that he can still do it, and then you guys are rolling, and then the same fucking thing, man. Breaks his foot. Shit's tough. I would be so fucking pissed right now. I'd be so upset. Oh, he is walking now? What? Come on, son. Dude, that's fucking awesome. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. I know Milton. how it feels. Mr. Milton? Angus Come on. is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on! Move! Whoa! You're fucking dead. Oh, shit. I'll get him. You're alive? Try and calm him down. You all right, Angus? No, you don't. Whoa! Oh, fuck! <laughs> That's got to be stressful, man. Got to be. Fuck it, eh? Get the fuck over here! Shoot! Shoot! Fuck! Run! Now where are you going? How am I gonna calm this thing down? Your neck is like broken. Wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. There, there. There, there. Whoa, there. Whoa, there. Easy, easy. God damn. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. All better? Okay. <laughs> now, come on, you hunk of Chuck. You're lucky you didn't kill anyone. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> Good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. I find weird. I find it weird how bad Russell Wilson's been this year. Doesn't make sense. I'll get the coffee on. The dude's definitely easy to make fun of. He's so fucking corny. I'm headed to work today myself. No one thought he was huh? bad. Stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. Cleaning at the doctor's office. Bye. Bye. <laughs> get the place to tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. He gets <laughs> shining. Yeah, no, I mean, from your perspective, it makes sense. I mean, I'm a Raider fan, so I kind of like it, too. Babe, you know what I mean? You got an answer for to me? some degree, Mr. but... Gettys, I... Still weird as fuck. I said, Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to full, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. 
I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my <laughs> Broncos country? Let's stuff? ride. He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong. Broncos country. Well, let's my ride. My wife will need help with this mare. Emotional. You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. Come on, he's over here. I'm good. You get on. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems. And I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all. Hmm? Laramie boys. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. <laughs> so, uh, is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Oh, when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. Oh, uh, okay then. All right, he'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get to. Thanks, kid. I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. Need a hand with that horse? No. Well, <laughs> you sure about that? Maybe. Okay, yes, yes, I do. Pretty big one. <laughs> That's Jeremiah. Hey. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. Settle down, okay? Come on. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? Oh, calm down. He likes you. I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. <sighs> That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. Let me ride him a bit first. Get some of the spunk out of him. I'll be in the corral, Ben. Come on! Where's that big, mean horse? Gonna run around like crazy or what? We hop some fences? Yeah, boy. Yeah, Jeremiah. Come on. Let <laughs> it all out. Of Let's break some fences. <laughs> Sorry. Energy. Show me this. That was fun, wasn't it? You can behave now, can't you? All right. He's ready for you. Okay. Get on up there. Go nice and slow. Jeremiah's good at breaking fences. Not my fault. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. My heart's beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? 
You think my son could borrow one? Huh. Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich, way richer than Pa, and he's got all these hired guns out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just It was, Johnny. Yeah, we played the Chargers. Yeah, but... But... Just worry about the horse. Yeah? Yes, sir. Yep. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you. You, Mr. Milton? I thought you were gonna help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my Thank husband. Thank you, Mr. Milton. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. This is the stall. <laughs> Mr. Milton. So... You know much about birthing a foal, Milton? Not too much. <laughs> oh my God, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he. What are we in our division? And it ain't hunting for I think we're hands. third. We're a game behind the Chargers it's now. Not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Our only Are chance is a wild man? card spot. The Chiefs are in their division, so it doesn't really matter what our record is in that regard. Got him. Okay, now hold on and pull. Oh, I slipped. Oh my God! What the? Get hold of it again. You'll know him when you got him. Grab <laughs> them. Not much longer. <laughs> okay, well, I think she's. Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, we're, we're a rancher. Feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but... You think Jolly I Ranchers originated? Oh. Because they were a candy the they gave, like, just ranchers would eat. We had any to keep them happy hands. as they're yeah. going, we going ranching boy. for 16 hours. Oh, uh, I'm, I'm busy. Uh, just too busy sucking on hard calls. candy. Of course. Good day, Mr. Feels Milton. like it. I it was weird. Smurf, what a <laughs> what a smurf! If it, it felt like it, Arma. Hey, John. Marston still Jim. got it, dude. Sorry. So, this is what you wanted: fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on, please. For me. For him. How's he been? He's been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Come on. Listen, son. Round to the left. What do you see? The pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, 
What up, Smurf? How you been? What you been gaming on? Come on, lady. Let's go. What you been gaming? How you doing? Fine. Can we go home? No. You're. Stay calm. Where would you like to go riding? Aside from home. I don't know. But maybe that stream. Good idea. Now you know all this. Get him going. Come on. You know. The horse can feel your fear. Just act confident, okay? Uh-huh. Confident. Yep. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. I feel like I should be on the other side. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick and a... I don't fucking know. See, you can do it. Now how about you speed up a mic? Okay. Whoa! You know, this ain't so bad, sir. Good. Amazing what the right horse and a little confidence can do. I don't trust this kid. I think we're going fast enough. <laughs> Even Fuck faster. It. Come on. Faster? Yeah. We can go even quicker. If you say so, sir. Yeah. Now really stick your boot in. If you say so. Come on, boy. Okay. Let's go across to the stream. Yes, sir. Get back. You think you're ready for a little race? I guess. All right. We go back to the path and up to the ranch. Okay. On my go. Go. Uh, dude, you're not winning, Jack. It's not happening. Hey, come back here. You'll have to catch me. We're setting an example. Your horse is much bigger. And you're much smaller. Like a jockey. I played Let's over a hundred hours of Red Dead for this moment. I am beating you on the horse. Play more Red Dead, Jack. Level up or something. Oh, this fucker took a shortcut. You are so up your ass. You little shit. Fuck you, kid. What? I beat you. I beat you. I well beat ridden, son. I beat you. Like I said, your riding has gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. You need it. We're fine, ain't we? 
Old habits. Investigate the disturbance. I like guns. your mouth boy you will be the first one we kill yeah. leave him alone <laughs> oh careful boys careful yeah. look at this tough guy get out of here how oh, fancy pants get he's paying you to be tough for him huh <laughs> no he's paying me to keep the place clean oh. said he had some problems with vermin Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, oh, okay. Come on, get him Come now. on, get him. Oh, kick his head in, boss. <clears throat> I couldn't stop him, Jim. Yeah, I'm gonna smell like cow dung, boys. <clears throat> it's like that, huh? When was the last time you had a bath? Uh, Teach that boy a lesson. Oh, boy. Mr. Miller. Oh, he's licking you, boss. <laughs> they didn't hire you because you're tough. It's because you're stupid. Boss, boss, you need help? That boy can punch. <laughs> He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in the brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a... That talks a lot of shit for just getting his ass whooped. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, mm. will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. Just call me a moron. Come on! Not a moron. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. That is a good quote. I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any. That is a good it. quote. I'm a fan. In front of the men. You toad. All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Oh, that's shit, Mr. Geddes. Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Yeah. I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. <laughs> Anybody want some more? Are we just not feeling dinner or what? No, no, I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston. You're such a pig. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible suit. All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. And we're just gonna Good let night, all Jack. that food get away. Night, We'd rather starve than Good eat night, dinner. Jack. Good night, Pa. What the hell was that? What are you? What are you doing? 
My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Son of a bitch. You gotta do something. Two of them by the stalls. We got them all. It's a rich man's father. Who's this? New hand? my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks it can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I guess sir. we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim, I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. <laughs> Come in, it's me. Oh, Abby's not gonna like this. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We, I. What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah, yeah, right. There's no way that's them right over there. They're this close. These neighbors can't get along. That really is them, huh? Off your horses here. We'll be better on foot. Okay. If Fucking so. terrible neighbors. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. Imagine. A couple suck. guards out front. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Yeah. There's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to Pronghorn. I thought I'd come down here. You're all so tough. Come have a word with me. You here to cut a deal? You're too late, partner. I'm here for our cattle. And to teach some manners to all of you. <laughs> you seen how many men we got? As many as money can buy. Now, get out of here, Hayseed, before you get a hole in your head. Just shoot him. I tried this. I'm just shooting where the shots are. Let me deal with this. Oh, a forehead. That's a bad business, Jim. May God forgive us God will thank us. Damn Melton, you son of a bitch! I 
see you, Milton. You're gonna be sorry for what you've done. You're gonna pay, all right. Hey. Hey! I know you're in here. Oh, you fucker. Backwoods, Shaka, no good trash. Oh. That woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's got to make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes. Dude, first, the cover photo. Dip, get the stink of you off of her. Farmhand. The Red Dead Redemption 1 cover photo. Oh, man. I love that so much. I'm looting up. I don't give a fuck. All right, we're good. Not going to loot up that much. Oh, my hat. I left it. I want to play Red Dead 1 now. I can't lie to you. Hey, you're back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, uh, <laughs> that weren't nothing. Well, you, oh, you, <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Whew. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about Abe? Just in case you stay up. Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. We'll do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? <laughs> oh. What choice did I have? He is not pleased. Just answer me that. Not pleased at all. What was I supposed to do? <sighs> oh, that's just hilarious. Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. Fuck, that's funny. She is just not into it. And I cannot fucking blame her.
My track record is not good. How are you getting on? Surviving. I think. Here. I'll get you some coffee. Only thing I know how to do is... Well, no. Undertakers like me. Cattle? Not so much. That ain't true. I ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was... I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. I'm tired, John, and <laughs> I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just... Do kind of do that. Hopeless. It's true. You're doing better. Milton! Milton, ma'am, Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lancelot. Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name. My name. I think so. One's in your name and the other one's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes. A real keen purchaser of goods. Me. Look at me. <laughs> okay, Lancelot. We'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. I'm just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. We'll save the real exciting realities of adulthood for another What up, Kylock? Yo, oh, yo, yo. Yeah. You take care now. Of course. What up? It's nice getting out of the house, huh? I like being in the house, Pa. Life ain't just about doing things you like, boy. What happened the other night with those men? Did you kill them? I did what I had to do to protect you. Ma said it was pride or something. Your Ma was wrong about that. I think they will. Was for sure. I absolutely think they will. I just ran over a Here. fucking bird. Want to take the reins, little? I think it lived. I, I don't know, Pa. Uh, it's easy, boy. Don't be scared. Well, uh, what do I do? Well, just hold them and pull them short to slow down. Tell him to go faster, give him a little switch, and then pull to one side if you want to turn. Here, try it out. Yeah. Strawberry. I think they will, Swaz, for sure. Dude, I could even see another prequel, but you play as Dutch. That would be fucking tired. That's enough. For now. Back in strawberry. Eh? Especially because at the start of Red Dead Redemption you know, 2, this is the longest I've seen Dutch is very likable. Your hand. It was foolish to forget. That would be tired. I think they could easily do that. Especially with like Colm O'Driscoll killing his girlfriend and all that, and he killed the O'Driscoll's brother. Dirty Dangle oh, Boys. What up, fam? Very good going on my guy I think that's the move that'd be sick you're big chilling hell yeah trying to bend my ear fuck yeah dude that's what I love to hear big chilling is the way of life dude all right 
Here we are. You all right, son? Sure. I think I'm gonna restart my game after we get the mail here. You wait here. Game's a little choppy. I won't be long. Okay. How we doing in here? Excellent. And if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Doing excellent, Can't dude. Wait. It's ending the weekend on a good note. It's been a great weekend. Hi, I'm here. To name? My name? Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Uh, maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Marston. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Nope. Nothing here for that name either. Uh oh. Try Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Hmm. Yes. Here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> and I will help you out. <clears throat> I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Here, let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Uh, it's, uh, mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very Bad. much, Mr. Jamie, what up? What's going on? Okay. Yo. Let's get out of here. Everything okay, Pa? Nope. Oh, sure. <laughs> I hope so, at least. <laughs> yeah, absolutely here. not. You take the reins a little. I ain't sure. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Okay. Okay, Pa. Pa! Yeah. We're going back to Pronghorn, okay? So, wait. We've come all the way out here, and we're just gonna turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out, uh, I miss the seclusion of the ranch more than I figured for. Don't you want to go to the store, or the saloon, or anywhere? We're going back, okay, boy? But, I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. But nothing. Keep on driving, and watch the road. Yes, sir. Thank you. Jesus. I'm your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Yes, sir. Better. Got my reasons. Look, if I tell you to speed up, speed up. If I say slow down, you slow down. I don't okay? like that guy up there. Uh, sure. All right, speed up. Let's get away from there. Okay. Yeah. What's going on, Jamie? What you been up to? Yep. Who's this? That's a football Sorry, game tonight. Sir. Should be Is over, right? Almost over? No. no, keep driving. Yeah. What was that sound? Is that like a spidey sense? Yep. You could say it's over. Cowboys whooping it or what? Oh my God! Huh? What? Nothing. Just keep driving. Yeah. Yep. I don't like this. Oh boy. Okay. What? What's wrong? Don't look around. 
Oh, Pod, hey. those men, are they following us? Just, just stay calm. See that fallen tree? When we get there, stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pa. You need to do exactly as I say, boy. Here, now! Uh, come on! Quick, down! Okay, son, you wait here. You don't move or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Okay, gentlemen. Let's see what you come calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Are you John Marson? You sure look like him. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just here with my son. Did you kill a fella out in Roanoke a few months back? Sure. He had it coming to him. That was my brother. Huh. I see the resemblance. A pair of goddamn morons. You're talking bullshit, mister. Kill him. That's insane, Guy Log. It's okay. Yeah, that game's fucking over. Keep them eyes closed. That Let's game go. is over. No question. Come on. Get it up. Oh, am I driving? I'm driving. Oh, dear. Those men. I told you not to look, boy. Are they dead? I didn't have much of a choice. You saw that. He's Never really dead. Compose yourself. This is slow. Super you dead. Them, Son, I need you to hold it together. You were real brave back there. Real brave. Just stay on the road. Be exactly like I said. Really? As far as I know, Kylock, I don't know much about him to be honest. I don't watch a lot of cowboy games. Real wrong for us. Didn't tell you. Yep. Kyle Lock. Yep. That's what happens. This is cool. I like it. I like it a lot. If they make a Red Dead 3, I think they should keep doing what they're doing, where you play like the section before the story. I think you should okay. play as Dutch. Hey, I think uh, that would be tight. You know, if they ever made a Red Dead Three. Mama wants us to buy some old ranch. You read to her about it, didn't you? Thank you for the lurk mm -hmm. heart. I appreciate oh, you, bro. Mm -hmm. Much what love, dude. Today? Or play as well, Hosea. Home. Hosea's That's cool. Right. Home. He's not really like a oh, gunslinging outlaw, God. though. You like the idea of that, huh? Me too, Kyle. Me too. I don't know. I can see you as ranchers, boy. Dutch to Mike. You. Like Mike is a rat. No one likes rats. I wasn't so sure, but... But Dutch? Yeah. He's pretty likable in the beginning of this guys. game. Wouldn't be such a chore the horses we were cleaning up after was but I think they can show, like, no, why he became likable, mm. you know? What made him a good leader before the moments of Red Dead. Red Dead 2, I should say.
Dutch to who? I have no idea. He might not even might How not even need to do that to be honest. What happened? Yeah. It's I don't know. I don't. No idea. We got shot at. Shot at? What happened? Well, we got followed and then we... Followed by who? Probably someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. Our son. I... Was your dress that caused all I don't know how it would even even work with Sadie. It was a gift for you. Fucking up, Marston. You're still outlawing. You're still slinging. Hey, Mr. Jim? Mr. Jim? Hey. Uh, there's a telegram messenger for you over there in, near the house. There is? Okay. Thanks, Abe. What do you think you want? I have no idea. But I doubt someone wants to give me a big pile of money. That's him. I see him. Thanks, Abe. Excuse me, mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes, here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. I've got something to discuss. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. Yes! There most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. I'll be damned. Oh, yeah, bud. We can make a run to Valentine, too. We need to get our hair cut. We need bald Marston. Abigail. Darling John, a kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had men problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I have begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. We got a son. I got a son, and I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... Part of you is hell-bent on ending up the same way. And I love you too much to watch that no more. Abigail. Balls. Arma, probably. Ooh, art. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that. Might as well, man. Where's the wife, Milton? I'll add you. Uh, After this cutscene, bro. I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags. What's going on? You married Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a showgirl? Or hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. I can handle a gun, sure. 
Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting. Unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done. Unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. No, I got you. I got you. Uh, let me open up Notepad real quick. Boom. Ba 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 boom! Let's go. Oh yeah, bud. Do you after the holidays? I'd be tired if you got a new rig. Oh, that's always exciting. Always exciting. Are they dirty dangle boys? It's good. Competition's good. Nice. Hell yeah. Radeon. Fuck yeah. Very good indeed. Those ARC cards by Intel, they'll only get better too. Big fan. Good for all of us as consumers. That flashbang was nice. <laughs> but that's her full. Nice. So. Hey, you know, I was wrong about you. Miss running Turned Deepstone into a crit. Fine worker, Jim Milton. Oh, thank you. It means a lot. I love that raid. Hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offering me some guidance. No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak, at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. Man, we need a haircut. We need bald Marston. Hey, son. How's that bull? Fine, Mr. Milton. Your father in? Could I have a word? I do miss sure. Deepstone Crib. Well, I'll just get him. Pa! Hey, I'm right, True. right here. <sighs> What's the problem, Milton? I'm sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. Hmm. Experience I think every man can relate to. In some ways, my wife... My wife also has 
issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Hmm? Do you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? I guess I don't know. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well, besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own so I can prove to my wife that I've changed. I understand. But I ain't got much money. I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could go to the bank and put in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. But take my advice, Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget all about family. I'm just joking, son. <laughs> just make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. He's a distant <laughs> cousin. Here's my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. Oh, He'll fuck. Get what you need. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I was young and dumb once, too. You'll get her back. That was pretty fucking funny. He's like, ah, I'm just kidding. I love how the game bugged out and it shows me with my saddle right now. And my pouch, the same pouch that Arthur had. The satchel. Got my holster, got my satchel already. Now it's now it's loaded in. Epilogue part two, right? Let's go get a haircut. What is all this? I still can't save? My God. Let's go up to Valentine first. Or no, should we? I do feel you know what let's go get our loan let's go handle business we haven't been to Blackwater in a while we're going to Blackwater Inbound, dirty dingle boys, inbound. There's gotta be barber. There's gotta be a barber in Blackwater. i 
last and I've been living too long cruel, cruel world I'm gone handlebar mustache no beard life At what point does Trevor Lawrence buzz his head? Dude, never. That dude looks like Fabio. That's something you just keep. If anything, he's sucking because his hair is not long enough. The beard life, you do. You have a glorious beard. Glorious. I've been living too fast, and I've been living too long. Cruel world, I'm gone. Browns won today. Nice, nice. Who they play? Texans. You you think he needs to cut it then, huh? <laughs> Wait, Arma, aren't you a Texans fan? See, I think his hair is just not long enough. That's what I take it as. The mission just complete now? It did. I've been waiting to save my game forever so I can literally restart my application. Oh, you live in Houston. That's right. That's right. Oh, that's awesome. Dude, Jalen Hurts is tight. I'm a big fan of Jalen Hurts. You think he needs to shave his head to get right? I think in order to get right, he just needs to not be a Jaguar. Me too, Guy Lock. Big fan. <laughs> Uh, it's like Derek Carr. I could truly say this as a Raider fan. I think his career would have been better if he just wasn't a Raider. <laughs> I'm sorry. But they did. They won today, Kylock. He is art. Jalen Hurts is tight. Car holding the Raiders back? Fuck no. Our defense has played better the last two weeks against good football teams. And we won. It's crazy how that works. My game crash? My fucking computer crashed. Motherfucker. Yeah, we took the lead in the third quarter and they kept it. They never let it go. Kind of nuts, man. Doesn't really make sense. Honestly, don't see that much different. Overall. For the, the Raiders, I feel like they've actually played consistent. The only real difference is these last two weeks, their defense is actually making big stops and getting turnovers. Josh Jacobs has pretty much torn it up almost all year, definitely most of the football games. If they can 
if the Raiders can find a way to play a complete football game, they can beat anybody. And I mean that. All right, it'd be nice if my computer didn't crash. Big fan of that. <laughs> Dirty Dango voice. I thought that was going to happen. Oh, man. And I was dreading it, too. Oh, fuck. I'll be honest, that still seems like the most probable outcome of the Josh McDaniels led Raiders. Because history repeats itself and the Raiders like to move off coaches really fast. Really fucking fast. Like Jack Del Rio, we went 12 and 4, the next season we went 7 and 9 and they fucking fired him and hired John Gruden. Which even back then, I'm like, yeah, it's justified. You know, he let the offensive coordinator go. He was the best part of the offense. Who the fuck is Todd Bowles? Not Todd Bowles, uh, whatever. Todd Downing, that's the offensive coordinator. He's the offensive coordinator now, the Titans. Fuck, dude. I love that intro so much. I don't think Brady will ever be a Patriot again. Oh, uh, I think him and... I don't think him and Bill... Belichick see eye to eye on how to win anymore. But yeah, Dirty Dangle Boys, if I was a bet man, I still think that's going to happen. This is what it is. I hate that it's true, but it won't be a one and done scenario, but I still think that's the best chance to... Uh, of, of, to of potential outcome, you know? I do. I don't think the Raiders... I, I can't answer that, Kylock, and I don't want to because I don't want them to fire anybody. I want them to actually stick it out. I'm going to reset my capture. I think the Raiders should stick with Josh McDaniels. Oh, that looks so much better for me. Oh, man, that's night and day. Is that a plant? The poppy. The Raiders could legit lose out the rest of the season, and I would still want them to stick with Josh McDaniel. I don't want them to fire anybody. You need continuity. Morning.
Is there a barber in Blackwater? Does anybody know? Yep, never mind. I see it. Post? Oh, jeez. All right. Fuck. Jeez. Oh, that's why I couldn't hitch there because you're hitching there. You claim the hitching post? All right. I got this one, man. Okay, girl. Stay here. Want to talk about it? We can talk about it. Oh, my God. I can't beat a bush. <laughs> you're a fool. I'll whoop your ass, bud. Yeah, I saw that grill. Pretty nuts. You guys heard him call dibs? <laughs> All right. Hi there. Come on in. What's up, bud? I got dibs on this chair. If anyone asks, I could fuck off. Bald Marston. There we go. Oh, yeah. Our, uh. Get out of the way. Ain't worth the trouble. Oh, there we go. Oh, that feels so much better. Oh, the sun feels good. Excuse me, sir. Can I can I help you? Yeah, I'm looking for Mr. Atherton. I'm a friend of Mr. Getty's over at Pronghorn Ranch. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Mr. Atherton is in his office. Hey, please head in. Thank you. Yeah. Can I help you? I hope so. <clears throat> I want a loan, sir. A line of credit, so I can buy some property. What property? An old ranch, Beecher's Hope. <laughs> that old dump? I, I know it ain't much, but I ain't much of a farmer either. But I will get there. That is a very unusual way of asking for a loan. Mr. M Marston. Marston. Only folk around here call me Milton. It's kind of a joke, I guess. <laughs> a joke, huh? And which folk? Mr. Geddes. Uh -huh. I work for him. He said that you could help me out. I mean... If you can. So old David Geddes told you I'm the kind of man to loan a man with two names money so he can buy a rundown farm on account of his lack of farming skills, huh? <laughs> Don't sound too promising when you put it like that. <laughs> well, how would you put it? Sorry to waste your time, sir. Oh, sit down. I'm sure we can figure something out. Now, of course, we'll be expecting <laughs> you to make regular payments. And no given love loss. lack of much evidence you got any means of repaying, the terms won't be too great. But if my cousin vouches for you, it'll be okay with the bank. Really? <laughs> Absolutely. Thank you. Now, of course, we'll be expecting our money back regular as clockwork until the debt's settled. Otherwise, the farm reverts to the bank, no matter how much you paid. I understand. Mm -hmm. Well, why don't you go check out the land while I fix the contracts and talk to Mr. Geddes. Oh, I heard there's squatters up there. We've been having so many problems recently, they'll need clearing on. Sure. Well, come back when you're done and we'll fix up the paperwork.
You're a good girl now. Oh, it's Gavin's friend. Oh, that's hilarious. Or wait, wait, wait. Or is that the same guy? I don't remember. No, I haven't done that at all. The Gavin stuff. Can I help you, friend? Oh, really, Art? So it's it is different people, but they're looking for the same guy. I hope so. Who's in charge here? No one, Mister. This is a free country. <laughs> now that I ain't so sure about. Listen, I'm buying this land. I'm afraid. Afraid you guys are gonna have to go somewhere else. Who's this? I ain't sure. Some fancy dang city boy says he owns this land. Or he's gonna. Owns it? That's what he says. Okay. And how come we live in here? I ain't sure. Get the hell out of here. This land belongs to me now. Ain't nothing on this earth belongs to no one, partner. Looks like you made your decision then, partner! <laughs> I'd be so dead. <laughs> They have three guys with guns pointed at me, and they all died. Gunslinging! Oh, yeah, bud! Ah, it's you! The man with two names and no past. Come on in. How'd you make out? Well, let's just say there are no more squatters. Okay. Well, I got your paperwork ready. Now, you sure about buying this place? It's really run down, and the price isn't too great. I think it would mean a lot for my wife. At least mean I was listening to her. Okay. Well, sign here and here. Sign of my life away. Now we own you, Mr. Marston, and we own Mr. Milton, too, and we own your property. But you can buy your freedom. Each week, eventually, you will be a homeowner. I understand. Congratulations, you are now a real American, indebted and owned by the bank. <laughs> I'm joking, they own me, they just own your property. Now, you can also use this line of credit for any home improvements you need to make, of course. I can? Sure. Be good, Mr. Marston. Welcome to home ownership. It's a beautiful thing. Let your wife know what to complain about. I'm <laughs> just joking. <laughs> Mike, uh, all right. Well, 
stone cold killer, dude. You. Well, I never. I, I thought Uncle? you were dead, boy. Dead. Uncle? The very same. Come here. <laughs> I saw you going into the bank, and by the looks of things, you ain't robbed it. I've gone straight. Oh, bull crap. No, for real. <laughs> well, I'm trying. All these years, you ain't changed a bit. Maybe a little bit. I thought you was dead. <laughs> not yet. Well, I got some things to take care no, of. No, not a problem. I'll come too. <laughs> no, you don't have to. No, I'm real sick, John. Lumbago. It's a slow and painful death, my brother. Evidently. Oh, have a little pity. He does come help build the house, though, which is cool. Huh? Come on, then. Yeah, let's go, right. Uncle. <laughs> Follow me. Uncle is a character. Walk. Keep What's walking. With you? Just walk, dude. You Where goober. West. West. So, what were you saying? You know, speaking in monosyllables don't make you seem interesting. It makes you seem stupid. I don't care how I seem. Well, now where west are we headed, you damn grunting fool? This ranch, I... A ranch I bought just now. Is that what you were doing in the bank? Spending all your money? Oh, I want a ranch in the armpit of West Elizabeth. Oh, my lord. <laughs> Not that that's any of your concern, but I was in the bank borrowing the money. Well, that's even worse. Yeah, you can run from a bounty, John. You can't run from a bank. Is Abigail there? No. She's, uh, her and Jack are waiting until I'm set up before joining me out here. <laughs> you mean she left you? Oh, I never thought she was a smart woman, but... You know, this makes me think maybe I was wrong. <laughs> no more of that. I just bought this place. And you're lucky I'm showing it to you and not looking for a place to bury you out here. This is it. Look at her. Okay. Look at this dump, but it's my what dump. What do you think? Why exactly did you buy this dump? For Abigail? Why? Is she an idiot? No. What were you thinking? I don't know. She said she wanted it. She ever seen it? What are we going to farm here? <laughs> Rocks? We? You don't have a hope here without a wise hand at the tiller. Enough of that. Get out of here. On your way. No. You're stuck with me. Seems I'm stuck with you. John, the rock farmer. <laughs> so, you think I'm an idiot? No. I know you're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Thanks one to no one. Uncle knows what an idiot looks like. And right now, it's me. Oh, yeah, bud. I hope we're not cooking them up. I'm back, girl.
Do we ride out and talk to Sadie? I feel like I should change my clothes. This is my cabin. That's my cabin, right? My shit cabin. I love Breaking Bad. It's such a good fucking show. It's... Ugh. As good as that show is, it's so depressing. Fuck. Whoa. Sleeping? Morning to you. Morning. I have no wardrobe, huh? Man, what a cabin. Let's go kill Micah. I'm pretty sure that's what Sadie wants to talk about. And let's be honest. Let's go, girl. I'm fucking in. I'm so in. Probably don't need everything on Ultra, right? I didn't know I was get. I just got a package today, but I didn't know. I didn't know it was coming today. Here's what I got, Chad. So I think many of you seen. It's been a while, but remember when I used to have that Destiny One poster? of all the exotic weapons. I still have that poster, but it's in a cheap picture frame. But I had the idea, it's a really nice poster. Oh. Somebody! Hey you! You! Please! You gotta help me! Why are you all bloody? Thugs. Been wanting us to sign our land over. Only this time they... I escaped, but they... They have my husband. They're gonna kill him. Abel Stuggs, huh? Where are they? It's the stone farmhouse back there where I came from. I'll head there now. I'll see about finding more help. Go to hell. I think she's setting me up. Um, you remember it, Art? I love that poster. It's a really nice looking poster. But the weapon, the weapon print itself is a little... A little glossy, you know, compared to the rest of the poster, which is something I always liked about it. So I got a movie, a movie poster frame for it with LED lights in the frame that shine on the poster. I'm hoping the lights on it make the weapons pop. That might be fucking sick. And if it does, then I'm going to hang, hang the poster behind me on my desk setup. Not here, but... When I'm sitting at my desk, I think it'll look tight. You don't sign this 
it's over. I'm gonna take a long time on you. Let's do it. They're killers! Get them! Oh, you're real. Hey, untie me, will you? Oh. What yes. up, Kakashi? What's going on? Thank you. Thank you. Did you? Goddamn bastards. Fuck yeah, Kakashi. That's tight. My wife. You seen my wife by any chance? Yeah, I saw her. West of here. She told me to come find you. Oh. Oh, thank God. But thank you for hearing her call. Where are you, my dearest? Dude, a gold nugget. Look at us. That's fucking tight, Kakashi. How was it? Was it everything you would hope for? Nice. Fuck yeah, Jalen. That's sick. All right, girl. That's tight as fuck. Old Comic Con. Almost ran into a fucking rock. Is that a bear? I didn't see it, but I heard it. the water at. Dude, I saw that picture at Funko headquarters. At least a few of those pictures. Kakashi, the Jurassic Park ones. That was tight. That was sick. I didn't even realize it's 9.25 already. We had a late start today. I wanted to stream earlier, but I got distracted with kind of cleaning again. I'm guessing it's a good, good problem to have, but we got to get a haircut first. Gots to. How do you do? You got a problem? No, I don't got a problem. Yeah. What's in 
your head, friend. Man, I am struggling right now. Okay, this is not going well. All right. You know, horse. You're a good Let me You're making me, you're making me look bad out here. Lord. Yeah. Horse? You see what I can do with a shooter? No, I don't. I don't. I don't want to see that at all. You forgot yourself. I'm literally just trying to hitch my horse. That's it. But everything's freaking out around me. Uh. Rush it off. Hang in there, girl. Come on. Oh, as soon as I walk in here, dude, it's gonna be fucking Sadie Adler time. I'm gonna save right here. I actually don't remember this being a mission. I just remember this being dialogue. But regardless, I'm gonna save here. Yep, we're doing it. Savages all covered in furs looking for scouts in the mountains. Howdy. Howdy, Hello. friend. What's up, dude? Are you looking at me? How does you? I do good. Easy. Can I not? Can I not? Can I not? Okay, I thought I could sit down. Can I not? Just trying to take in the sights. Good old muddy Valentine. You have some Funko bop heads. I got a few too. I'm with you. I got all the Jurassic Park ones, the OG Jurassic Park ones. I thought about getting rid of them though. I don't really have like hold, hold it. the drive to collect them, you know, so I just kind of have them to have them. But yeah, a lot of people are into them and I get it. There's a lot to collect too, which is pretty badass. Howdy. A lot to collect. And I also open mine because I'm a fucking goober a creature trying to sell yours grill. Do it, dude. Get that moony. Hey, partner. Nice, Kakashi. Nice. Howdy, partner. Howdy. Howdy, doo All right, guys. It is 930. Also got that package I want to open up and see if it's everything I want it to be. Oh, GG's, though. That was a fun stream. That was fun gaming. Short stream. Only... Yeah, like just two hours. Um, tomorrow, I plan on waking up bright and early, getting my morning run in. And then after work, I don't know who's playing the Monday Night Football game, but I plan on playing some, uh, playing some more Red Dead. We're not done yet. <laughs> We're not done yet. We got a yee-haw. We haven't yeet our last haw yet. We got to keep going. Bald John Marston time. We did Bald Arthur, now it's Bald Marston time. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate it, Art. Chat, you all rest well, too. Take it easy. Have a wonderful rest of your Sunday night. And I hope Hello, you have sir. a good start to your week tomorrow. Take care. Peace. Peace.